Hello everybody, welcome to a build, I guess, I don't really know what to call this, but this is American Truck Simulator guys, uh, and I am Kamich the Trucker. We got a Peterbilt 389 modified truck mod, and I am now going to build my official cat uh, truck. So, let's get started, because there's going to be a lot to do. Alright, so we're going to start with a cap. This is the most crucial part. We can do flat top, 63 incher, ultra sleeper cap, ultra cap sleeper, we can even do day cap, ultra cap, we can do all of this. I think for a cat a day cab might be better but as of right now I think we need a flat top mostly because it looks clean it's nice and flat top peter belts are amazing so we're also going to have uh, a glitch truck, as you can see, old mod, so uh, we can't use that. So let's go for not lowered. We don't want to lowered. There we go. That's what I want right there. I just want standard eight by four. There's one reason why I want this setup specifically, and we're going to change those tires here in a second, but we're going to keep going. Alright, uh, I'm going to try to plow through this as fast as I can, so we're going to find, so we got a 610 Cummins here, 550, 550, 605, 25, okay, it looks like 610 is going to be our max for tuning, ooh, there's an 840 chip tuned, we're going to go with that one actually. Alright, uh, this we want as much for heavy cargo and hills transversal and uneven terrain. We don't really care about normal cargo because if we can haul heavy, we can haul normal. So we're gonna we're gonna go with I think we're gonna go with the 18 speed maxi torque. Yeah, let's go with 18 speed maxi torque. That gives me max these, and I don't really need that. And that's obvious because of this. It doesn't turn, so. Alright, and then we're gonna go uh, pick our dash. Do we want an old dash like this? Or do we want a new dash like this? The old dash sits higher. New dash sits lower. Oh, let's see, what do we got here? We got green, red. Everything is red. I like, we got a black, ooh, we got a black, let's go with the old one, alright, and then this is the crucial part, because I got both of those, since we got 2016, it doesn't work very well with this cab, so we're not going to do that, we got the classic, classic 389 Viper cat, we got the 2018 cat, looks glorious, we're actually going to keep that color as a preset. Um, let me see here. Yeah, we're going to keep that color as a preset. And then I think we got... There you go. That's it. That's what we need right there. Right there. I like that. Alright, we're going to go with that. Alright all of these points. We gotta get through all of these points guys. Every single one. So we're gonna start uh we're gonna start right at the front. That's one of, so we're gonna have we're gonna need an oversized line. But I'm gonna take it right back off and uh change uh this. So we're gonna have the Viking three to nine. Yeah, but we're gonna have to take it right back off. So we gotta remember to put it back on. Alright, um what's this? 
Oh yes, this is okay. So caterpillar heavy hull. Yeah. No, we could do it with the poles or without the poles. Uh, it doesn't matter. I think with the poles will look better in the end. So all right, now we need to change. Uh, can I use these yet? No, I cannot. Okay. Who should we go? Um, I'm going to go right here, but we're going to alternate them. So we're going to put left here. Yeah. Alright, that works. You know, there's a glitch there. You can't see it. It's inside it. I don't know why. Alright, so... Uh, I got the bumper. Can I put my banner on? Is the next question. I do not have my banner accessory anymore, which is okay because I don't really. Need it. What does this do? All right, fender guards. I don't need fender guards. Um, okay, got the bumper, the grill. Let's look at the. I think the pride is my favorite. No, actually, I like. 15 bars black mesh yeah, yeah that's the most clean one in my opinion all right we're gonna go uh we're gonna go blinker bar led paint changes this bar right here all right um then we're gonna go what we got here headlight wise Nope, don't need those ones yet. We are gonna need these ones, the Viper ones. They have the flashing headlights. Now there's four, I forgot which one we want. That gives the chrome, I don't want chrome. I want this to make, be, now that one. That one looks nice. It's only on one side though. I just know. So we can't uh, do that on either one. So uh, where's my blinker bar? There it is. So we're gonna go blinker bar LED. Yep. All right. And lights. We're gonna change. Let's go look at the first one. Yep. Chrome. So we're gonna go with four. like we're gonna go with a uh, chrome I guess guys that just looks like crap what's the difference between one three uh, I see all right we're gonna stick with that all right we're gonna go light accessories 389 LEDs? Question. Yeah. Alright. Um. Now, granted, this will be a hot rodded version, so there is going to be a few slight modifications that aren't technically legal. Alright. Do I want to put. I want to put this one on here, I believe. You can't really see it. Um. What's this one? No, let's go with the Viper Chrome look. Uh, nah. Alright, what do we got here? Okay, let's see these headlights. Ooh, that's my tanks. Nah, yeah, we're gonna go like this. I don't need fender mount bigger just because I got up here. Step what is this from flags? Uh yes. What's here? Nope. Nope, we're definitely gonna need the 
for uh, better visibility. Alright, front fender. We want a heavier. Yeah, I like that. Alright, let's see what else we got here. Alright, um... What's this guy here? Okay, nope. Black Convoy rubber deck. Yeah, let's, let's put you on here, definitely. Alright, what else we got? Uh... Logo. I like the pride and class of Peterbilt. That tag. I love that tag. Painted rivets. Let's go. Well, let's go chrome. Yeah, let's give it that nice pop. Uh, hood handles. Yeah. I got some handles right there now. All right. Um, what else we got? We got. Plates. I don't want plates. Okay, don't need customizations there. Uh, I want to keep that the same. <coughs> I am going to add lights there, though. We're going to do. Uh, Yeah, we're going to put lights here. We want people to be able to see us. Actually, I got that backwards. I always do that. I always get my back, uh, forwards and backwards mixed up. Uh, yeah, I think that'll do. Alright, we're gonna go, uh, let's go painted doubles. Don't want to put any lights on there. I don't like window trims. We're gonna go with a, a red interior. Um, what is this? One bolt. Okay. I do not need any of that. Okay, got that one. Got that one. Right, we're gonna go up now. So we're getting to the top tab. Oh yeah. I don't specifically like those bullets. See if we have any others. I doubt it though. Yeah, we're just gonna have to stick with the basics. Which is okay. I I guess I can survive with those ones. They look a little weird to me, but it could just be because I'm so zoomed in. Now we're gonna put not that there. Alright, we're gonna go roof accessories because we're gonna custom light box here and we want our horns our customary horns there we go yeah all right Okay, so now we need to put in, uh, um, yeah, we just need to find the right piece. 
pieces. What is here? Okay, I don't need that. Um, oh, here's the most fun part. We're gonna put eight inch bullhorns on here. Look at that beast. Alright, uh, okay, we do that. Antennas, we want the first one. Always the first one, so I don't like it angled. There we go. Alright, so we got all of these points. We got those points. We're gonna work away. We want. We don't need an arrow kit. Alright, uh. That'll come later. Okay, so now we're gonna work on everything on the side of the cap. So we got the fender, we already did that. Here we go. Uh, we want. We want custom light bar chrome. Eve one has uh, too much uh, LEDs for what I want on this truck. Okay, so those two will be blocked. But we're gonna put something on there anyway. Alright. We're gonna put orange neons down here on these ones. And right here. Alright, and then right here we're gonna put your standard lights. So they can't kill use these because they have that issue. They good because they're insanely brighter. But these will do for now. side and do the exact same thing. Alright, sorry about this guys, normally people would just cut and edit this, but I, I want this to be as raw as possible. I misclicked. Um, yeah, I don't want the whole shipping of this, that, and that. Oh, I fucked up. I don't want you to see it. I want you to see me fuck up. Honestly, I, I really do want to, you guys to see me fuck up may not be my main goal, but uh, I do fuck up a lot. I do mess up. And yeah. So, alright, we got that. Now it does look a little weird with nothing here, but... Eh, to each their own. I like it. Alright, we're gonna do custom... Um, paint. We're gonna, we're gonna do custom paint. That's what we're gonna... Paint, and then there's paint B. That one looks better. Okay, we're gonna add uh, lights here. What else we got? Actually, I'm curious. Oh, here we go. Air clean light. While I can see these, go here, 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 and here. Right, we're going to switch to the back and do the red ones. Alright, um, okay. Get this done as fast as possible for you guys. I don't want to hold you up. Alright, that looks nice. Got them all on the same side, same color, yes. Okay, so that's good. Now we got the step. What's the classics? <laughs> yeah, see we got the classic uh, ones and we're gonna actually do those. <coughs> and put those underglow lights on. We're gonna do orange underglows. Grab that point on the other side. Save me time. Alright, so we did that. We don't need a window trim. 
Here's the fun part. Alright, so we need a full tank. And I love the look of that tank. Alright, what do we got here? We're gonna go frame base color. Gonna leave that uh, backside. Alright, here is the fun part. Is I gotta put lights on every one of these points? Not every one of them, but I like them right here on both sides. I usually ignore the top. Uh, Almost done here. And we're gonna flip to this side and get all of these ones. Okay. Oops, there we go. And and then there's one other thing we're gonna do. We're gonna find our classic neons. We're gonna put them all along this window area. It's gonna be interesting. Now I know you can't see them, neither can I, obviously. Um, I don't know why they don't pop up in the shop, but they're there, and you'll see them in a second, as soon as I, uh, showcase this. Uh, well, you will see them if you watch my next video, which will be, uh, the showcase and delivery of a special transport, uh, video, which we're gonna do. I haven't picked out the place yet, but... We're getting there. Alright, uh, got that done. <coughs> As you can see, lights here. I may actually... No. Oh, I know what I'm going to do. Okay. Right here. Actually, I don't want those there. I want... These... was my original plan. I kind of lost track of it. There we go. Uh, interference with the cat symbol here, so I'm going to get rid of these. There we go. Yeah. Alright. Um, did all that. Alright. Did that. Windows fine. All right, now we're gonna do our uh, rack, um, rack caterpillar. That's the one we probably specifically want. <coughs> All right, and now we need to find our uh, beacons, which are these. So we got all these choices here. We got this one. Um, probably gonna stick with an LED. I think rotating for these ones will do me good. Uh, and this one, we need the big boy. Yeah, big, big boy. And what do we got here? Okay. Alright, we're gonna, we're gonna figure out what rims these are. So these are Akoa Disc Standards. Oh. Uh, 
I never knew I had these. These are new ones. Interesting. Alright. So we're looking for Alcoa Disk Standard. There we go. And the tire we're looking for is Bridgestone for Alcoa. There. Alright, and what do they got here? Yeah, we're gonna go. These, alright, we're gonna look at what, what do they got? Koa Hub 1. Alright, we're gonna go here. Nuts, we're gonna go. Uh, uh, and we're gonna go hub, co hub one. Alrighty, here we go. We're getting somewhere. Alright, this one all I have to do is change this. And we're gonna come up to the front and do the same. Quick, and then we're gonna work on the rest of the truck. Alright. So we got the rack. We're gonna need this. Actually, we're going to change to our Caterpillar 63 inch. forgot that part so this needed to be shorter it is fine we will deal with it actually yeah we'll, we're gonna deal with it it'll be fine all right so we're going to uh what is this oh we're gonna get rid of that because we don't need the fenders anymore all right let's start up here so right here we're gonna do an underglow if it allows me to. And it doesn't look like it will, so we're just gonna have to put LEDs right there. And we may change these to actually, if I can get these to show there. So clear LED light. That's pretty bright. Uh, we're gonna go with that one, yep. Actually, the orange will suit uh, better, actually, in my opinion. So, orange LED light. Uh, we're gonna put it at the top so we know. Alright, we're gonna nail all of these points here. Oh! There we go. Uh, Get right here. <coughs> Flip her around. Put them right here. There's a reason why I'm skipping those. You probably already know the reason. Fuck. Uh, actually. No, I can't put Ellie Neons right there. Alright, uh, light, orange light, light, almost done here, guys, as you can tell, we'll get to work on the brake lights here in a second. Now, I could actually change my cab really quick. But I'm not going to. Alright, let's uh, find our deep light bar. There it is. Do we have actual... Oh, there they are. There's the beauties. Alright, we're going to change 
you go to actual LEDs to give you that bright effect. Actually, alright, where'd it go? We're gonna take you, you, you. Ah, crap, misclicked. And you off, we're gonna leave. If this can be a turn signal, that would be great. Doesn't look like it. Alright, that's fine. Alright, so we're gonna go and change up these really quick. Because those original ones just don't make us visible at all. something we're going to have to change right here is this because as you can see there's a glitched error right there. This would never be able to open in real life if that was there. So we're going to kind of hide it a bit and go with Now it doesn't really hide it very much. So I guess we're just going to leave it. Hopefully they fix that. Alright, now we're going to come back here. I'm going to go to this middle one here. Alright, a fair combo. I see that looks nice. Alright guys, that's the outside of the cab. Right, we're going to go an interior view here. There's things I need to add, like I need a GPS. Um, nothing there, we are actually going to change these from a chrome to red. Actually, let's go paint. There you go. Alright, um... We're gonna ignore that. Uh, stare away. We're gonna go with a more... Suitable steering wheel. Uh, let's see what we got here. Decisions. No, I'm not gonna go. Well, actually, it does match the truck paint and gives that nice theme look. So, why not? I uh, nope. Actually, we're gonna go uh, blackwood because I love the blackwood. All right, we're gonna go twin stick. Twin 
sticks look nice. Um, classic, classic Playboys. So actually, I think 2008 Christmas edition. Cube or classic Rubik's Cube. There it is. It's currently broken. Alright, um, nope. Uh, seat items. Do we want to put anything in the seat? Oh, there. Wait, there, there it is. Let's go. Do we. See that a ten gallon hat. Let's go with the hard hat. It's more suitable because you know, yeah. Is it okay? Uh, all right, that's it, guys. Uh, so um, there she is. So, uh, that is this video for today, guys. I will um, see you in the next video when I do the showcase. Later.